Hello everybody, welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Kayla. In today's video, I'm going to kind of take you guys along with me while I meal prep a few meals for the week ahead. Today is Sunday, so I feel like that's the best day to meal prep for the week ahead. Welcome back to my kitchen. Let's get started. We're gonna be doing two different kinds of meal preps, but we're gonna do five meal preps, so five days of the week. First meal prep is I'm going to be meal prepping some salads. So we're gonna need a lot of veggies and some lettuce and dressing. Let's get it all ready. So first things first, we're going to get all of our like veggies ready for the salad. So we have to cut some things. Hold it all together like this, as you can see. And I'm gonna chop it so that it's like little pieces, you know what I mean? Okay, so I'm gonna make a salad with Caesar dressing, balsamic dressing, and then this like lemon poppy seed dressing. So first, what you're gonna wanna do, put the dressing on the bottom so that it doesn't like sog up any of the vegetables. So now that we have our dressings all in there, ready to go, I'm going to start cutting my veggies because you don't wanna put the lettuce with the dressing just because it will like sog up the lettuce and that would be gross. So we're going to put like the more hard vegetables, I guess, um, in it. So I love these little carrots, like the little matchstick carrots. I'm just gonna get like a handful and put them in there in each one. I think I'm gonna do like most of them like with the same veggies just because I love all of these veggies. I think I'm gonna cut up some green onion. I like green onion because kind of has like the same taste, not completely, but kind of, of like real onion. And I like the taste of green onion better than the actual onion. And you don't have to burn your eyes off while cutting it. I'm just gonna simply put some of that in there. I feel like it just gives such good taste, green onion does. And then I thought what would be fun was to put some cilantro in maybe like one of them. I don't think I'm gonna put them in all of them. This is like the only ingredient I think that will only be in one of the salads and make them a little different. But I think that adding a little bit of cilantro, do I want it in the balsamic one? Yeah, I think I do. I think it just adds like a little extra flavor. Next are some tomatoes. Let's add a little bit in each. Tomato is not my like favorite. Like I don't just like eat it like as a snack with stuff, but I like it when it's there, you know, it adds some color and you know, I don't hate tomato. I used to hate tomato, actually. Next is cucumber. I love cucumber. It's one of my favorite veggies. So we're just gonna add them in, honestly. Okay, next one is a red pepper. This is my other favorite veggie. I've always loved red peppers. I'm gonna cut it in strips and then I'm gonna cut it in half so that it's like bite size. So now we're going to add our lettuce. That's a lot of lettuce. And when you put the lettuce in it, I just feel like it looks so cute. You can really pack the lettuce in there too because there's a lot of veggies in there. So you're gonna want like a lot of lettuce. Okay guys, we're almost done with this one. So this is what they're looking like so far. As you can see, super colorful, super pretty. Oh, this is like the fun part. This is my favorite part. The little add-ons that make it just oh so good. So we're gonna add some avocado. I like to add this on the very top just because if I add it anywhere else, it will just get mashed and gross. But I'm gonna do this on the very top. First, I'm gonna actually squeeze a little bit of lime just because I love lime and just for that extra flavor, it is so good. So I'm just gonna squeeze some of that on top. And we're gonna add some cheese. This is the cheese I'm using. I'm going to put some of these like Southwest tortilla chips for like a little bit of crunch. This is like one of my favorite parts of any salad. I have to have a crunch with my salad. So I'm gonna put a pretty good amount of those in there. 
Then I'm gonna put a little bit of seasoning. Sometimes I'll put like more when I actually eat the salad, like some pepper and salt. But um, pepper and salt, some pepper and salt. Whoever says pepper before salt? Some salt and pepper. Uh, but I'm going to add some everything but the bagel seasoning on top because this stuff on salads is so good. It just really brings all the flavors together. <laughs> then last but not least, we're gonna do some avocado. I absolutely love avocado, so I have to do this. And get like a little spoon and just scoop it out and put it right on top. So we're all done with the first meal prep, our meal prep salads. So this is what they look like. They're super cute. Um, so now we're gonna put the little tops on them and we're gonna pop them in the fridge so that they stay fresh until we eat them. Okay, so for the next meal prep, I'm gonna be using these really fun like meal prep containers. I just got them from Walmart and it makes it very easy to put a whole meal in them. So we're gonna be making like a chicken and rice kind of like meal prep with a side salad and some crunch. So first things first, I'm going to get my chicken. My dad cooked this chicken and he just, he cooked like a whole chicken. <laughs> so I'm just gonna be using the leftover chicken to put on my rice. I just have like a whole chicken breast right here and I'm just going to cut some of it like and some slices to put on top of my rice. I'm gonna be kind of making like a teriyaki like rice bowl kind of thing. So we have our chicken all cut. Now I'm going to scoop some rice into like the biggest part of these containers. And I already made some white rice in the rice cooker. Okay, so I have my rice. Literally all I'm gonna do is just like lay the chicken right on top of the rice, like so. And then when I'm ready, like when I'm going to eat this, um, if I were to take it like to work with me, like to go, I would just get like a little tiny container and put whatever sauce I want with it, um, like teriyaki. Um, or if I'm just eating at home, I'll just throw some sauce on it because you don't really want to put the sauce on it right now because it will kind of get gross and soggy. I'm going to put a little bit of red pepper flakes on top of the chicken and rice just to add a little bit of spice. Okay, so next part of the little dish, I'm going to be using some of this leftover salad. This is my favorite kind of salad. It's like the Asian style like mix that you get like in a pre like already mixed like bag. If I find a picture, I'll put it right here, but it's the best like pre-made salad. We get it like literally every week and we eat it all the time. It's so good. The dressing that comes with it and just everything, but I made the whole thing tonight and have some leftovers. So I'm just gonna put it in here so that I can eat a little bit of salad with my rice and chicken. Already looking so good. Ta -da. Look how good that looks. Okay, and then for the last little space right here, I think personally I'm going to put some crackers just because I love myself a crunch like with rice and stuff. And so yeah, I'm gonna go grab some crackers. So I'm gonna be using the this one, Mediterranean like potato mix. I'm gonna use that for one of them and throw in a few of these like little sweet potato crackers for one of them. And then for the other, I'm just gonna put these little, these are my favorite chips right now. They are jalapeno lime like bean chips. They're so good. Last but not least, I steamed some broccoli. So I'm going to be putting a little bit of that just like on the top of the salad, but I'll probably eat it like with the rice. Okay, you guys, so this is how it turned out. I feel like with meal prepping, like they look so cute when you make them and they just look so put together. Just so easy to just grab and go. And honestly, I'm so glad like when I meal prep cause it makes me so happy to just go in my fridge and grab it and go. That's those. Again, I'm just gonna pop the lids on these, put them in the fridge until I'm ready to eat them. Alrighty, everybody. So that is the end of this video. I hope you guys had as much fun as I did. <laughs> I hope you guys seriously go and try out these meal preps. Even just if you do anything out of this video, make one, at least one of the salads. I promise you that you'll have a fun time making it and you will love it. And you can personalize it like so easily. Let me know if you guys liked this video. Leave a comment down below telling me which like meal prep idea was your favorite. And also if you wanna see more meal prep videos. 
If you haven't subscribed already to my channel, please do so that you don't miss any of these fun videos like this one. It would mean the absolute world to me if you did as well. I hope you guys are having a wonderful day, night, evening, morning, wherever you are. And I hope you accomplished whatever you wanted to do today. And yeah, I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.